repaired the beach. There's no deputies on the beach. Well, about 4.30 this morning, we got reports of uh, people yelling in the water here off the coast of Del Mar. Uh, upon arrival, uh, there were uh, approximately 11 people that we found in the water uh, <clears throat> that, we, uh, that we rescued and are now being treated at local hospitals, all with uh, minor hypothermia conditions. Uh, we have reports that there were about 16 people in a ponga coming up from Mexico. So that's the number that we're going off of is 16. So we got approximately five that are unaccounted for. Uh, we don't know if they made it to shore or not. So uh, we're presuming uh, that they get, could still be in the water. We started doing a, a box search. It's uh, transitioning over to a grid search and then we'll, be, we'll actually be doing a line search, which will make it more thorough. Uh, we'll be out here for several hours doing that. Well, it's been reported that this would be a, a, a dump and run where they uh, don't actually, the Ponga doesn't actually make it to shore. They'll uh, uh, have people swim. Uh, off the coast and then they head back south. We have had a lot of Ponga boats uh, that have reached our shores here in Southern California, specifically this, this area of the coast here. Um, it is a multi-agency effort with San Diego lifeguards, Del Mar lifeguards, uh, Solana Beach and Encinitas lifeguards. We have boats from Oceanside Harbor, uh, the Coast Guard as well as San Diego City and Del Mar. So it is uh, a, a federal, state, and local um, effort here. Um, we got helicopters, both from uh, our, our from the San Diego City Fire, helping us out as well. They're advising all the